Hi Bruce, can you introduce yourself? My name is Bruce Edmonds Jr. I'm a 40 year old male and I've had a major ischemic stroke back in 2014, which has left me paralyzed on the left side of my, of my body. But I was a professional musician before this incident happened, involved in the nightclub industry here in Melbourne and the music industry throughout Australia. What is the hardest part about having your stroke? The hardest part about having my stroke is the fact that I'm still paralyzed on my left side and I need the help of carers, of my mum and dad, especially at the moment when they're in their late, late I mean, in their 70s. And my mum's got Alzheimer's, my dad's got heart conditions, and I should be looking after them, but instead I'm having to learn to walk again. What are the feelings you've encountered around this? Look, the feelings around this are a lot of sadness, anger, and it's just, it lives with you every single day. What is your history in your field before your stroke? I was involved in the, like I said, the Melbourne nightclub industry and the Australian music industry. Can you describe how hard it's been to overcome this life-changing battle? It's been extremely hard because you have to learn to adapt to what you've got now. And what I, what I mean by that is the fact that you literally have to learn how to do, do things again, you know, to walk. You know, you take it for granted. And I've had to learn to walk again. And I've had to fight for that. And I've had to also learn to speak again properly. Who are the people in your life that uh, have been with you through your journey? Well, obviously my mum, my dad, my brothers and my sisters, but also my dear friends in Jenny and Effie and Gary Pinto, but also people professionally I have to give credit to is to Sam Ziramanis from Avoco Design. And he's been able to take the vision of MC Junior and the MC Junior project and put it onto paper. Without Sam, I wouldn't exist today. And also the fact that a guy called Joe Sofa at Concert Audio Visual, he's been able to help me achieve my musical performance to return to the stage. But also I have to say my, my cousins in Craig G and Dinesh. Dinesh gave me the first opportunity to re return or give, to take center stage at my Metro Underage events back in 1996. Dinesh and Craig, without them, I wouldn't be standing or standing on stage today. What are you currently fighting for in your life at the moment? The thing I'm fighting for at the moment is to get my hand to work again. I need to get to move because my left hand is completely paralyzed. My brain doesn't connect to it, so I can't open and close my hand like my right hand can do. Thank you.